So I'm an engineer, and I'm here to make light in the dark. On my PhD journey on illuminating the production floor, I had the pleasure to work with Bob here for three years. Bob is a production worker, working at a production line in one of the 10 million manufacturing companies worldwide. Bob might be producing products for renewable energy, the food, or the pharmaceutical industry. He's actually producing all the tangible things we use in our daily life. We need Bob. And we actually all depend on that, but he's sufficient to carry out his work tasks at the production line. And I strive to do that in my PhD research. So I started by observing and talking with Bob in more than 20 international manufacturing companies. And what I discovered there took me down the memory lane. When I was a seventh grader, I solved all my problem-solving tasks by pen and paper. Today, my laptop works the magic. So you might be surprised when I tell you that pen and paper boards is Bob's problem-solving tool. Actually, I discovered that 80% of the companies rely on such tool. However, it's not efficient because it consists of outdated production data. So when Bob here, he faced a production problem down the line, he needs transparency, he needs real-time information of what is happening in order to solve it fast. And he needs to do that because if production stops occur, it is not a good thing. Because in manufacturing, it's extremely competitive. So I argue that this outdated tool here is not sufficiently supporting Bob. Bob, he needs light. How to be able to do proper problem solving when you're navigating in the dark? You can't do such thing. And 85% of the com manufacturing companies I observed, they agreed upon that. Actually, 20%, they've already started updating the analog boards through a digital development. Unfortunately, no one has succeeded yet. But as an engineer, I think in solutions. So I teamed up with a large manufacturing company for two years, where we strive to develop a digital tool that aimed at providing transparency of the production line. And we did that by ensuring connectivity to systems, um, providing data in real time, and making sure that there's access to devices. So Bob here, he got his transparency on when solving problems. But we also learned that a digital development is not a straightforward road. But through my PhD findings, I learned that I can help Bob. So my research, it contributes to practical guidelines of how to develop such digital tool and making Bob here able to turn light in the dark which is beneficial for all of us, so Bob keeps on producing. And I think it's just as cool as the Harry Potter spell, light spell, Loomis, making light in the dark. Thank you so much.